the PROTECT-8 study is a phase 2-3 clinical trial looking at the use of JIVI uh, in prophylaxis uh, for hemophilia A. This is a, a study that went on for 36 weeks. Patients were randomized to every five and seven day dosing intervals um, in the extended dosing interval arms. Uh, at the end of the 36 weeks, uh, there was the opportunity to participate in the extension study, uh, which went on for a very long time. We have data from the extension study out to seven years. Um, this clinical trial was really the pivotal cl clinical trial uh, for JIVI, which led to its approval um, in many countries around the world. Uh, the clinical trial showed us that JIVI offers excellent bleed control um, at dosing intervals ranging from twice weekly to every five days, every seven days, and that the bleed control um, uh, continues and in fact is improved upon over an extended period of time in the extension study. So these data uh, are a way to compare um, uh, EHL drugs in the, in the absence of direct head-to-head -head comparisons. So this is a tool that we can look at um, to, to assess how Jimmy stacks up against other extended half-life factor eight products. Um, the data from this analysis shows that the mean or median annualized consumption of Jimmy uh, is, is about 20% lower uh, than the comparator products. Yes, we've been very happy to see um, in our real world experience with JIVI validation of what we saw in the clinical trial experience. So we have data from the Heme Power study, which is ongoing. Um, and then we also have data from the Athen data set, which collects data across hemophilia treatment centers in the United States. And from these, uh, these data sources, uh, we've seen a very nice validation in our real world experience um, uh, of JIVI. Uh, what we saw in the clinical trials is in fact being borne out in the real world. So it's been very gratifying to see that uh, in our actual clinical practice.